process after we've loaded it full of catalyst and methanol is to turn the machine on. There's a switch on the back. You'll hear a fan kick on. And now here's the hardest part. You reach out, you reset it, you push the start button. In about 20 seconds, the light's going to come on in here. A huge stirring motor is going to start in here. It's going to begin dumping methanol into the main tank. There it goes. You can hear it kicking on. I'm now going to put some sulfuric acid into the machine to get things, help things a little bit more. And then we leave it alone for 24 hours. We're going to come back. We'll have glycerin, drain it off. We'll show you what we get after we wash it. The next step is to put sulfuric acid into that machine. It allows us to get better yield. And so we're going to put 380 milliliters of sulfuric acid into there. Simply pour it down. Watch for my mark. Put it in the big machine. It's incredibly important that you're wearing safety thing, or safety gloves when you do this. You're dealing with sulfuric acid. There's one. And two. What I've now done is I've placed 380 milliliters of sulfuric acid into here. The process will begin. I put this big lid onto the machine. And I leave it alone for 24 hours. When I come back, I'll have finished biodiesel. I drain off my glycerin and we can begin a wash.